Billy Bays here. Uh, I just want to go over uh, a little bit of the, the toy news this week, just a, just a little fraction of it, because there's always a ton going on. But they finally had Shimu from SH Monster Arts go up on Big Bad Toy Store. $239.99, $24 NRD. If you don't know what a non-refundable deposit is, it has where you're going to give them $24. Bucks. And by, let's say, if it is February 2025, if you don't buy the whole thing, uh, you know, pay the difference. Uh, they get to keep your twenty-four dollars. Just putting it out there, just in case you didn't know. This is not the best price for Shimu, though. Uh, the best price still that I found is eNightMedia.com. It still has where it's two thirteen sixty with free standard shipping within the contingent. Conti- contingent. You know what? I'm just gonna stop trying to pronounce things in the U.S. Uh, it also has a twenty-five dollar uh, NRD on it, but it's a little bit cheaper. So if you are genuinely interested in Shimu from uh, Monster Arts, this is going to be the best price right here, $213.60 that I found. So take that as you as you may. But the other, uh, the other uh, big news that I was super interested in is Joy Toy finally revealed their TMNT stuff. This is 4-inch, 1-18th scale figures. They're up on joytoy.com. They have where if you buy directly from them, if you're overseas uh, in, I believe, like mainland China, yeah, mainland China, Taiwan, Hong Kong, and Manchuria, it's $143.97, and they cannot deliver to the United States. Everybody started freaking out about this, worrying, oh, scalpers, only way you're going to get this and stuff like that. But this is a big brand it's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. They want to make money. So, uh, obviously, after a few days, it started to pop up on the other websites that usually carry Joy Toy. I don't know if it'll ever be on Big Bad Toy Store, but keep your fingers crossed if that's your main mode of uh, ordering there because it is on 5K Toys. That's see here. Let's see. They got all four. They have the individual four. And here we go. Full price for the whole set is 145 plus shipping. Their shipping's pretty good on there so it shouldn't be too much um and then individually individually for 36.99 again that's like five dollar deposit per figure or 35 for the set and they're looking at quarter three quarter four for release also another great website that has them ea collectibles this is in canada but they have 16 dollar flat rate shipping to the u.s they're 164.29 here uh, also, they apparently have Sezzle. I do not have Sezzle, and I don't Sezzle around, but it's there. Also, about the Shop app. I imagine you also use PayPal, but hey, they're on there as well. They're also on Show Z Store. You can buy them individually. They don't have a group set on there, but it's dollar deposit, thirty-five ninety-nine each. They have where they're basically the same store that Gundam it is. Kind of, kind of like that swap there, guys. Yeah. Gundam and Shozi are basically interchangeable. One has more Transformers and robots than the other one. Be what it is. They still have a deposit a dollar, full price $35.99. So if you want the Joy Toy TMNT figures, they are available to you outside of mainland China, Taiwan, etc. You can get them in the U.S. You can get them in Britain. You can get them in Australia, probably with a really, really ridiculous shipping price there. I feel your pain. But... Uh, that's the news for Joy Toy and TMNT. One thing that is not toy related that I came across this week that I thought was really cool and really neat is Audio Adventures. This just popped up in my Facebook, and I what caught my eye was the old school look to it. It has where it's a throwback to text-based computer gaming or just choose your own adventure books and things like that in a radio drama style, which I think is really neat. And it just has like this great, almost analog, just look to it. But being that it's audio, it also has Braille on it. And it has where it's kind of made so it's easy for people who may be blind, visually impaired, or just people who cannot play regular video games to play with this. Um, They got three main games they're offering at first. The Psychotronic Mind, which is like a a World War II... uh, uh, 
what was it? World War II psychic Nazi drama there. You're trying to stop them from getting their hands on this technology. Um, Hotel of Secrets, where you're an assassin that has where he's lost his memory. And uh, Bewilder, which is a young girl lost in an enchanted forest and trying to fend off all sorts of uh, boogities around there with the help of a cat, which I thought was really neat. But it's not up for Kickstarter yet. Um, they have a couple offers here. If you pre-register, you can receive two full games with your audio adventure unit if you buy the base unit. The second bonus, this is what I did. Um, when you pre-register, put in the email, you get an incredible discount, a massive 45% savings on the system, and three full price games. I just had to put up a dollar. And it said it was refundable too if I did not go through with the purchase. But like this thing's like 79 bucks right here. Uh, I believe it's what it threw up when I did it. 79 bucks for the unit and the three games. And it seemed really neat. They have uh, their YouTube up that does like a little kind of demo there. But from the looks of it, this thing's really neat. It's cartridge based, which I, I think is really cool. I hope it does catch on because I just like just the look of the unit. The analogness to it is just super cool. And this is TrumanToys.com. Um, they also have a Facebook group. Uh, I think it's Audio Adventures. It has where you have to, you know, sign up here to get invited to that. But like it's got some uh, neat videos in there of the actual board that's inside there. Uh, it's going to have like an like a headphone jack on the side there to keep it more accessible to everyone. Uh, volume control, cart goes in the side. I thought it was really neat. It does have where this looks like a lot of AI art here, but I understand using this as like maybe a placeholder or it's just, if you're just one guy doing something, I can kind of feel you, man. I can kind of feel that you're trying to get things done and you can only do so much by yourself and still keep costs down. So let me know what you think down in the comments below on Shimu for $213, the Joy Toy TMNT, and what do you think of a text-based or audio-based video game with like an analog kind of setup there? It's I think it's really cool, but tell me what you think down in the comments below. And uh, if you're interested, take a look at this. Uh, hashtag not sponsored. But this has been Billy Beige, and I'll see you in the next video. Later, guys.